Hey and welcome to Moi WB channel. Let's begin with our daily news. Barcelona earmarked Arsenal striker Alexander Lacazette. Barcelona has reportedly earmarked Arsenal striker Alexander Lacazette as a transfer backup plan should they fail in pursuit of Borussia Dortmund's Erling Holland. That's according to a recent report from Le Ten Sport, who claims the French attacker is wanted at Barcelona by manager Xavi. La Gazette, 30, is going to be out of contract at the Gunners at the end of the season, and although manager Mikel Arteta recently confirmed the club plan on opening contract soon, there is no guarantee that the striker will extend his stay. Should La Gazette fail to pin a new deal, he will be free to leave London for a free once this season comes to a close, and the club understood to be very well positioned to sign him is Barcelona. The 26-time La Liga winner's first choice summer signing is Borussia Dortmund's Erling Haaland though, and also Barcelona is thought to be in talks to sign him, with the likes of Real Madrid and Manchester City also keen, landing the prolific Norwegian will not be an easy task. Following the recent free transfer of Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, Barcelona could be set to capture their second Arsenal striker in as many transfer windows. For Lacazette, a move to a slower-paced La Liga could be hugely tempting, especially after watching how his former striker partner has reignited his career in recent weeks. After scoring just four times in the Premier League prior to his January move, Aubameyang has already netted the same amount of goals, but in just his first five domestic appearances for his new club. Should La Gazette opt to follow the Gabon International's lead, it will serve as a huge blow for the Gunners, who would have lost two senior attackers, both for free, in the space of six months. Fabrizio Romano provides update on Arsenal target Fabian Ruiz. Fabrizio Romano has provided an update about reported Arsenal target Fabian Ruiz on Rio Ferdinand Presents 5. The Gunners are likely to bolster their midfield ranks in this summer. Mohamed El Nini is set to leave Arsenal when his contract expires at the end of the season. Ainsley Maitland Niles, Gunner's future is uncertain, while Roma are reportedly still eyeing Granit Xhaka. According to Career dello Sport, Arsenal have launched subliminal messages towards the Napoli star. However, the Gunners probably won't be the only club in the running for Ruiz. Career dello Sport claimed Man City, Liverpool, Man United, and Newcastle are also eyeing him. Indeed, the Magpies reportedly made a £40 million bid for Ruiz in January, but Napoli turned it down. The Spain International's contract expires in 2023, so there could well be a bidding war for his services in summer. On Rio Ferdinand Presents 5, a fan asked Romano whether he felt Ruiz would come to the Premier League. Romano said, fantastic player, and yes, there are chances I would say at the moment. We have rumors about some club like Newcastle, but he's not negotiating yet with these clubs. He wants to understand what Napoli want to do. His contract runs out in 2023, so there will be a meeting with his agents to decide whether he stays or leaves this summer. But for Fabian Ruiz, there are chances. I would say Premier League or La Liga because many, many clubs are following him. Liverpool join Arsenal in Alexander Isaac race. Liverpool are also interested in Alexander Isaac, according to a report from the Sunday Mirror, with Arsenal already in the running to sign the striker. Isaac has had an interesting 12 months. He was outstanding in La Liga last season, scoring 17 goals in 34 games, and he went on to have an exceptional Euro 2020 with Sweden. His form has not been quite as prolific this term, however, he still has 8 in all competitions in 31 games for Real Sociedad, and the interest in him only appears to be building up. Reports have claimed that Arsenal have already made contact with his representative ahead of this summer. The Gunners are reportedly prepared to spend £70 million to bring the Swede to North London. However, they are set to face plenty of competition. The Sunday Mirror reports that Manchester United view Isaac as a potential backup to Erling Haaland. Meanwhile, the mirror adds that Liverpool also now want Isaac. The report claims that Sociedad are prepared to sell for around £60 million in this summer. It's suggested that Isaac only wants to move somewhere where Champions League football is on offer. Therefore, 
Arsenal's fortunes over the next couple of months could have a major say on where the 22-year-old ends up. Should they qualify for the Champions League, they may actually become favourites. Arsenal could well have a completely new look forward line next season. Both Alexander Lacazette and Edin Kitea are set to be out of contract. Joining Liverpool, meanwhile, may be a daunting proposition for any forward right now. Their attacking options are absolutely incredible. Collymore urges Arsenal target Rashford to leave Manchester United this summer. Stan Collymore has told the Sunday people that Marcus Rashford needs to leave Manchester United for another top Premier League club in comments that may certainly catch the attention of Arsenal fans. There appears to be a large question mark hanging over the future of Rashford at Old Trafford. Reports this week claim that he is considering his future after falling out of favour. It would have previously seemed unthinkable to imagine Rashford playing his football elsewhere, but there are now plenty of sides monitoring his situation. Arsenal and Newcastle are both interested in Rashford, West Ham are also keen on the 24-year-old, according to reports this week. It remains to be seen how the rest of the season plays out for Rashford, but Colly Moore has suggested that he certainly feels that the forwards need a new challenge. Arsenal are moving in the right direction right now. The Gunners are currently in pole position to finish in the top four, and with that, they could be back in the Champions League next year. The future is bright for us, and Arsenal want to sign at least one new striker this summer, so there is an opportunity for Rashford to immediately make himself an integral member of the squad. I will be uploading daily Arsenal news, so keep your eyes on the channel, and don't forget to like and subscribe. I appreciate your support. Peace out.